Hello everyone, I hope you are having a nice day. In this video we will make real-time clock application. In the second part of this video, we will implement external interrupt. We create our project in Cube IDE. I will use STM32F103 as microprocessor. We make the necessary pinout configurations. In order to use RTC, we need to choose low speed clock as crystal ceramic resonator. Other settings as we know. Newly there is, we enter the RTC mode configuration from the timer section. Here we need to select Activate Clock Source and Activate Calendar. In the Parameter Settings section, we make our time and date settings. In the second part, I am setting these pins as we are going to implement external interrupt. These parts have nothing to do with RTC right now. Since my buttons are connected as pulled down, I fix these parts in GPIO settings and then I mark EXTI interrupts as enabled in NVIC section. This is how clock configuration and pinout configuration was. Now let's start writing the code. I am adding the libraries we will need. I define the variables that we will use. The procedure to be done here is as follows, we keep the time when our code first runs in a variable named first time.
we convert the time in this variable to seconds. and we keep the current time of the program in the variable named time, and we convert the time in this variable into seconds and assign it to the variable named current time in seconds. We check if there is 120 seconds between these two times. If it reaches 120 seconds, that is 2 minutes, we change the time OK variable to true. Let's start the debug process and check if our code works correctly. I'm speeding up this part a bit because I don't want you to sit idle for two minutes. Yes, our RTC implementation works correctly. 
we can both keep time and compare time. Now I want to move on to the external interrupt part, but I will continue that in another video. In the other video, we will do both external interrupt and RTC.